this location actually provides a perfect site for a mass testing site. Uh, I'm here off the Garland exit, I-49 just to my left. Now people will drive in through here, through those gates, which will be open to that building about 200 yards back. If you can see back there, tents will be set up, they'll be tested, and then they will drive out the very same way. Supplies are arriving at the Washington County Fairgrounds. Starting Tuesday, this place will be the center of a mass COVID-19 drive through testing site. We'll have tents that, that go alongside this, this beef barn behind me, and then patients will be able to drive through and have their PCR testing done, and then just circle back at the end of the drive here and go back out the way they came in. The effort is a partnership between the NWA Council, Arkansas Department of Health, and the CDC. Tuesday will be a half day, but by Wednesday, they'll have the capacity to conduct up to 1,000 PCR tests a day. I wish, honestly, we could have done it two weeks ago. Um, we, we submitted you know, our request to, to have this site uh, once we were asked to submit the request. And I think just a backlog of working through different requests that came from different states. And you know, now was the timing that we were awarded. The court says even if their efforts didn't time out perfectly, a mass testing site like this will go a long way to relieve overburdened medical staff. And so if we can help provide just a, a small break for those hospital staff that have been doing this for a year now, uh, just in, in take on the bulk or majority of the testing load for even these 21 days, hopefully that helps gives a reprieve into the hospital health care systems and provide that as an ancillary or secondary support. And to be able to take the stress off of them, off those systems, the clinics, the staff, um, it, it just really decreases that burden um, on, on the whole system. And like everyone else in Northwest Arkansas, Cork is keeping an eye on the forecast. If the Washington County Emergency Management Team signals that roads are bad in the event of a winter storm, well, the NWA Council will pause testing until roads are clear. Yeah, so it could be a bumpy ride on the onset with the forecast. Now, testing tomorrow will be a half day. It will go from 11 o'clock until 4. After that, 8 to 4 every day until February 21st. And again, the testing is free. We're live at the Washington County Fairgrounds. Paul Petit, 4029 News.